I'm here for an important protest against a corrupted government and a corrupted prime minister. They want to tear up the judiciary system of Israel. They want to tear up Israeli democracy. And we are here every week in every weather to make it and to fight against it and to fight for Israeli democracy. I'm here tonight protesting against the transition of Israel from a democracy to an autocracy in order to serve one person's agenda, the Prime Minister, who should be focusing on his uh, trial and instead is focusing on dragging all of Israel into some sort of totalitarian autocracy, all in his service. It's a disgrace. It shall not stand. <laughs> Netanyahu is going to change the whole system, the whole legal system, and uh, this is going to drive us to really bad places. How it works, it's very simple. Uh, in my view, we have two tribes here. The one sees Judaism as a nationality, and the other one sees Judaism as a religion. These two tribes has almost nothing in common, and this is the reason for this conf confrontation. This is the background. The trigger for this dem demonstration is Netanyahu trying to escape from his trial, trying to bend the whole legal system so he can get out of it. Therefore, I demonstrate here as a liberal, secular person. Well, hundreds of thousands of Israelis have been taking to the streets for over a month now because they are saying loud and clear we will not let this Israeli government take Israeli democracy away. And we will not negotiate our democracy. There is no such thing as half democracy, half dictatorship. They can call it whatever names they want, but we will not let them win. This is what everyone is here for, and of course me as chair of labor with all the members of my party are here to say and to make sure happens.